Oh, yeah, for well, a woman. Well, when I was in drama school, there was an advert in the listener, I think. Mm. And, and some, Ladies available. No. And some, uh, Ladies. And somebody picked it up, and a, a student. And he said, oh, I've got a job for you. Listen to that. And, and the Arab service was advertising uh, vacancies for uh, radio assistants, you know. I went in 56. Suez, 53. So it must be. So you it. came here in 52. You went in during the Suez so crisis. So that's. She went in after the Suez crisis. Went. She's definitely a spy. She's a spy. She's definitely a spy. She's, a spy. She's just revealed. <laughs> she went into the BBC she went after in the Suez The way she crisis. said Suez, she's. Definitely involved in the Suez Canal crisis. For any of you subs that Definitely. don't know this, we have this running theme that actually Betty is a spy. Yes. Betty Betty only reads with one eye, but she has two no. perfectly good eyes. She only ever drives using one yeah. eye and two feet. She, which, let's face it, in an automatic car is weird. She had sewers at the end of her fingertips too quickly. She says that she noticed my arrival <laughs> at the BBC and she was working in the French section, Ooh. very posh. And she asked for a transfer to the Arabic section. Ooh, <laughs> Betsy! <laughs> Betsy Boo! Betsy, you holler! You holler! Please holler! Come on, Excellent. Is this true? Go on, tell us no. your version. Your version. Well, I was working in the French service. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, you were working well, in the French service. French service, but yeah. it was Suez, and so they cut the French service by half and expanded the Arabic service double. Yeah. So, there were a lot of people in the French service who had nowhere to go, and there were a lot of places in the Arabic service. Tell me the first time you set eyes on <laughs> your future husband. Could you say you're better than Michael Parkinson? <laughs> I know, you're very good. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm really interested. Um, well, I think I was working in a ink, the, ink, the um, APO office. Yeah, yeah. Mary Lines. The yeah. head of the uh, Arabic service office, I was working in that. And how old were you? 20. Tw young. Eight, yeah. And he came in. You were only 20, Mum. Yeah. When you met Dad. Yeah. And this should have been a big warning to me, but I didn't take it. Oh. Yeah. Because he on. said, can I have a... Um, and what did you say? Have you got a camera? Looking in that filing photo. cupboard and saying, um, I need a picture. Of my mother, mm. something like. No, I need a picture of me to send to my mother. Uh, a picture of me to send to my mother. Right. Neck. I should have taken a warning then, shouldn't I? Really. Well, but the other day, day you mm. said to me and Stacey that you, when he said that, you then thought you were then hooked. Yeah. And I said to you, I think that's quite, a, that's quite a nice thing because instinctively you've gone, oh, he's kind. He likes his mum. He's stood. He's being no, I thoughtful. I just liked his voice. Oh, oh, did you like his voice? <laughs> So, so go on, what were you feeling when you said to me? Well, I just thought, what a fantastic voice. Oh. 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 Voices oh. are so important. I know, apparently. apparently. They <laughs> are, they're so important. Because I'd been to drama school and learnt a bit more about British society and how to deal with people. Uh. The Ara uh, my Arab is that a way? Is that a way of saying you were being a bit of a player? Today? No way. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I bought, bought her a pie and chips. Yeah. And my <laughs> Arabic colleagues used, used to say, every girl here is a girlfriend of Nadim's until she proves otherwise. <laughs> 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 because I was easy talking to them. Yeah. You know, while the newly arrived from the Arab world. The woman was oh, something awful. to be really? wary of. And they thought that if you spoke to them, you actually wanted to go to bed with them. Oh. That's what they, all of them. Well, all the Arabs. Yeah. Oh. Well, okay. they, they, because this is the, this is, the, this is the society we came from. Yeah. That, if that you was a society yeah. thing. If you addre address yourself to a lady, a, a girl, it's because you have designs. Oh. Or because, you know, you are about to get engaged or married or something. So were you immediately attracted to him? Yeah. His voice. And were you immediately attracted to Bobby? I'm on a close-up, Teddy. I was attached to everybody. I'm on a close-up, <laughs> Teddy. You got so your Tina's you face for that. I was, no, I was, I was uh, easy. You know, I was... Oh, my God, yeah. <laughs> I, was, I know that the strange thing is that 
thing is, the blokes in the Arabic service all thought you were gay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because, he, thought, was because he was easy to talk with women. Really. Yeah. 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 He I can't be that easy with that easy. Something oh, because he's talking to them and he's not having sex with yeah. them. He must be gay. Yeah. And because of his acting background, he was already easy just talking. Yeah. I think that's really yeah. sweet. Yeah. So, Nadine, when did you first realise you were attracted to Bobby? How far are you going to take this? Right to jump off the bridge in water. water. Say that again. What? When she tried to <laughs> jump off the Waterloo Bridge. Everyone loves a nutter. Oh, dear. Who's <laughs> 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 What? Did Nan try and throw herself off Waterloo Bridge? Yes, yeah. Betty, uh, yeah. it got to that point and then you left. What? You went to work in Paris. You went to le- work in Shea. Yeah, she went to Switzerland. Yeah. Had you been out? Had you been together? Well, we've been, we've been drinking coffee together for a long time. Had you, had you, had you been smoking? Oh had, you, had you been kissing together? Huh? Had, you, had you been... <laughs> no, nothing like that. Nothing. <laughs> Maddie was like, that's too much now. Maddie's like, that's too much. No. Maddie's like, it's too much. You're obviously not going to know tonight, are you? Yeah. No. So oh, is that? Apple Charlotte, there's no cream, but there's oh, one that's burnt. Oh. I have that. I you can't have that because it's got butter. Well, I was a girl. I Thank you. Oh, that's the one I'm doing with all of my face. That one came up perfectly, but this one no, is burnt. No, I want that one. You like burnt? Yeah. yeah. I like burnt. Oh, oh that's burnt. It is so difficult. Oh, do you want this? this? Beautifully done. You might like it. I don't know what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want some? It's got butter there. No, it's got no. apple in it. It's like bread no, and apple. I, oh. I don't know anybody that's made it since my mum made it when I was a girl. Uh, I remember making an enormous one for Nigel Slater. No, 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 Sam. Okay, that's right. Sam, Sam was here. Yeah. 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 So, guys, the pudding's all ready. That was the vegan chocolate tart pie. Dina caramelised some orange to go on the top, and we added some almonds for roasted almonds what do we think delicious is it mm. what the vegan one don't tell joe don't tell joe and betty how's your apple sh- your birthday apple charlotte, apple charlotte ever. Oh. now if you if that's looking burnt i burnt that on purpose because she likes it burnt yeah. it's better anyway because it's really caramel. Yeah. so we did well with the books yeah. So, it's the end of the night, Betty's had her birthday, I've given her a sweet peas in a pot, which I'm going to carry over with them. It's not 11 So Teddy, we've discovered you were a gadabout as a young man, haven't we? Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank God she didn't fully, fully drown in the Thames. It's 11 o'clock. Yeah. When did that happen? I thought it was like the nine o'clock. I have to be. Yeah. I'm not with seven, you see. No mucking around. No mucking around. Love hearing their stories. I know, it's great. It's been great. Oh, lovely. It's been lovely. For a lovely evening. Thank you. Thank you.
So you're off to the ballet tomorrow? Yeah. What are you seeing? Cinderella. Huh? Cinderella. Cinderella? But isn't that only at Christmas? No. No, no Cinderella is a Christmas stupid. <laughs> Cinderella isn't at Christmas, you stupid. <laughs> Lovely. Where's my skin? Cinderella. I said, isn't Cinderella at Christmas? And Matt Dean went, no, no, Cinderella's not at Christmas, you stupid. <laughs> I just said you look really slim. She said, "Is that the new door? <laughs> new door? New door? Isn't it yeah, exciting? Lovely, new yeah. door? Oh, no, Dad, I'm going to give you ten more guesses. <laughs> oh, it's not a new door. What else could it be? <laughs> the new door. Ah, yeah, the new it's a new door, door to a portal. <laughs> it's a portal door. Right. Okay. Well, I'm chasing your dad. Look, we better go quick because your dad's a bit of a gadaway. He might be off. <laughs> We'll pick, right. pick some bird up at the bus stop. <laughs> okay. Just so just don't let her jump off any bridges. Yeah, as long as we're not near Waterloo Bridge. <laughs> it's Betty. Betty's jumped off the bridge. <laughs> <laughs> what are you looking for? Your presents. Oh. Oh. Hang on. Oh, is this in that bag? Waterloo Bridge. Okay, Betty. <laughs> I can't even get rid of me. Cheap, <laughs> <laughs> man. It's dark out here. Bloody dark. Careful. Bye bye, love. I'm yawning and <laughs> inducing yawning. So we've just woken up, it's the morning after, it's Sunday, and Wait, we are all... Still talking about and yawning. Rachel just said her jaw aches from yawning, and then Dina, in inimitable Dina fashion, what does it mean? It means that, well, if somebody doesn't yawn when you yawn, you're yeah. a psychopath. <laughs> well, there were no psychopaths in the room last night. <laughs> you were the worse, because you were the one inducing us to yawn. I'm a sociopath. That's I'm a it. yawning sociopath. Yeah. So, but, so Alice is that you're somebody is taking more oxygen, so you take oxygen. Dina is, it's empathetic if you don't do you're it. You're a <laughs> Anyone else got any ideas so of Watch why? out, when you're with someone who doesn't yawn, when you yawn, stay Get away. rid of them, divorce them. Bloody hell. <laughs> I can make the dogs yawn by yawning. <laughs> you, you look, you look, look the dogs in the eye and go, <laughs> and they yawn. Dina, we did Wait, well, how did we get onto Wales yawning? <laughs> Suddenly, in the middle of it all, no, in the middle of it all, Ali said, what about sea animals? 
They don't yawn. Where do we get to see animals? <laughs> like manatees <laughs> and sea lions. We didn't have a conclusion. We didn't. Does anyone know, do sea animals yawn? And if they do, do they drown? Because they're underwater. In fact, if you think about it... Problem. I'm always close to sea animals. What are you talking about? I've, I've, I've been close to a walrus. They yawn. Can we turn you around? No, that's not me. That's you. No, that's not you. That's me. I just stand there. Stand. Look at him, girls. He's looking hot. Well, come on. Most of our audience are women. Apart from Joe. <laughs> who hasn't contacted me since he's proposed he's to his girlfriend. It's sort of well, awful. Right, well, it's sad. Where are you off to, oh, Dina? Cinderella. Tell us. Oh, Cinderella in the round. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I'll send you a picture of me and oh, my you dad. Do, do, do. Oh, so we're now off to Bermondsey Street. Are we going to the White Cube Mark? Yeah, there's a nice little exhibition there. There's a nice, there's a nice shop, little shop. exhibition. There's our favourite coffee shop that is called for coffee. For coffee. <laughs> Say it fast. For coffee. You're for coffee. For coffee. Oh, coffee. you said to me for coffee. For coffee. You're for coffee. for coffee. You're for coffee. Oh, you said for, to me for coffee. I said to you for coffee. You've got an Italian though. Because, it's, because it's, it's Italian, it's coffee. Is it? For coffee. You're for coffee. You know, coffee. they do that in Greece. Are you for coffee, madam? I go, yeah, hey, what are you for coffee? For coffee. <laughs> Waiter used to say, Oh, God. Thank you very much. I say, Thank you very much. I do the same thing. You wanker. Yeah, you wanker. Thank you. He's calling you a wanker. But anyway, I digress. We are off to see a little bit of our have a look in the shops. Well, not have a look in the shops. Have a coffee and just hang out with our lovely, lovely friends here. Hello. Because we've got to let them go soon and we don't want to. Don't go. Don't go. <laughs> Might sing it for us. Da, 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 da. Oh, that's what. Don't one. go. No, no, Please stay with me. You are the only thing I want to get, so get back. back. <laughs> get back. How are you feeling, Kooks? Well, We're dodging stats. pigeons at the moment because Kiki has a pigeon phobia, don't you? Why do you think you have a pigeon phobia? Who's got it's too scary. It's the wings. Like... Oh. Do you know the bit I hate most about pigeons? What? Their feet. Maddie once saw a pigeon with no feet. Oh yeah, I saw it as well. It was just lying. <laughs> was it just there lying like there? <laughs> yeah, it was just yeah. lying there. <laughs> yeah. But look up there, guys. Look. Imagine falling it's on that. That, that, that would tall. really hurt. It's not even that tall. Tall enough. So we're like, in. Said, no, I know what you mean. So we're in Bermondsey, <laughs> and we're about to go through a playground where the last time we came here, we put Nanny Die on the on the thing and spun it around. Do you remember? Yeah. Like mad. We need to find that film and embarrass her again. I love coming up here to Bermondsey with my girl. I love my girl. My French. <laughs> you're my baby girl. For as long as, even when you're 36, you'll be my baby girl. Sorry. I put a coat on today thinking it was going to rain and now I'm really hot. Just ahead of us are some of the most remarkable roses. Look at those. Look. Come and smell the roses. Oh, look at these. Oh, look at those. Look, I love, love pink roses. I feel a Greek photo coming on. Yeah, they're lovely. Oh, let's do a nice photo Look here, with guys. these pink ones over here. Oh, God, I love on Instagram. I was here the other day. Was she? I'm not even kidding. Who was here? Pink photo. Oh, look at those. Oh, the same as Carl. I love on Instagram. Look at this. Lovely, isn't it? Smell it, sub. Smell it, go. Oh, that oh. This one smells, is much more subtle, but it's, it's like rose water. You sound like a sommelier. I really smell night. Pardon? I love daisies. Yeah. I love a daisy. You're a bit of a daisy as well. I love it. I'm a bit of a daisy. Yeah, they are. I'm a bit of a hazy daisy. Oh, look, there's more roses. Let's look at these. Shitloads of it's like they've got shitloads of roses. A rose garden. I beg your it's pardon. It's a very famous song. I never I promised you a rose garden. Who was that? Ma Do you, Maddie, get Kiki, your name right. It is a real tune. You know it's a real tune, isn't it? I beg your pardon. 
I never promised you a rose. Who sang that? Oh, God, I don't know. Who did sing that? I think it's Kenny Rogers. Kenny Rogers? Yeah. I'll be. I'll be your boy then. I never promised you a rose. I think they've got rabbits here somewhere. I love a woman from the country who can yeah. tell us these things. Rabbits. They've got it's rabbits like, here, that really? Would have, I would never have noticed word, that. Rabbit would not have no, Bermondsey and rabbits. Yeah. Look at these subs. No, well, they probably are. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. Get a mouthful of that. Hey? <laughs> <laughs> Show us it. Look. Yeah. Oh, a rose. Que bella. Huh? And, <laughs> oh, my oh, God, that's so look white. Look at that. Paper woes. Paper roses. Do you remember Top that? Mum. Do you remember that? No. Donny Osmond's sister. What's her name? What's Donny Osmond's sister? Deirdre. Oh God, very famous. Deirdre Osmond. Osmond. Anyway, she had a whirring R, hey. and her, her she had a whirring R, so Rose. she roses, and she sang, and her big hit was Paper Roses, except she got. Paper rose. Why did she choose the word roses? I know, that's yeah, what we all thought, ridiculous. but it was a big hit. Why did she say paper thistles? Paper thistles. Paper thistles. Paper thistles. Paper thistles. God, these roses are oh so God. vibrant. Look at those. Nadia, look. There's a cover for a pillow there. There's a cover. Oh, yeah. <laughs> pillow. Pillow. <laughs> this rose is saying, come on then, if you're hard enough. Yeah. Stick your nose in me. <laughs> I'm going to stick, I'm hard stick enough. Stick your nose in it. I'm hard enough. <laughs> Go on, stick your nose. Oh, <laughs> that smells like swimming pools and sun oil and rose. Oh, it smells so many of coconut. Oh. Pillowcases. All I can hear is peak. Okay, mum, stop, yeah. please, mum. <laughs> so here we are in Bermondsey, about to go into the white cube. So if you like really weird, whacked out contemporary art, this gallery is really good. I've never so been good. here. You've never been here? Oh, it's so cool, so cool. What's it the called? White, the White, white Cube. cube. but it's such a great building isn't it Kiki that almost anything you put in here looks cool all right so we've got some more Sarah Morris on the left not entirely certain what I think of these We saw it. She would have loved it. She oh, loves Tracy. Oh, do you? Well, next yeah. time one comes up, we should plan for you yeah, to come and gorgeous. see it. It was fantastic. The Tracy, Tracy I mean, <laughs> I mean, this room leaves me oh, totally cold. Oh, leaves me totally cold. Yeah. So we've just come out of the white cube. We're a bit hit and miss, really. Ali was made to feel sick by the blue one. Um, and we were left cold by the geometric ones and then we watched a film at the back of the gallery that was just really boring, wasn't it? Anyway, we like the space and often their exhibitions are very surprising and I really like the room with the abstract ones. What's your mum talking about? Talking about blue whales. And blue whales. Has anyone else got a fear of whales? Is it a thing, whale phobia? I don't know. Barnacles. Everything's a phobia. Yeah. Whale phobia. Yeah, yeah. And actually freak out. Yeah, but that's that. Jevin used to play that when I woke up. He had that They're still talking about a fear of whales. <laughs> and, and Ali was saying that when she goes for massage, she has to ask that they're not going to play whale music. She said it's the huge, unblinking eye of a whale. Do you hate whale music? But does it scare you? No. No? I do like whales. You don't like whales? They're a bit too big. You can't put them in your pocket, can you? It's like even if you have a toy whale, it's enormous. <laughs> What whales are like masks? Like that's not. It's coming, and I don't know how to. I don't get. I really big fear that. What whales? Clowns and masks. Oh, clowns! Kiki used to be freaked out, which is why it's so bizarre that she loves it. That was my friend. Oh, lots of kids hate clowns. Check this out, guys. Look at that ceiling. Oh yeah. Look at that. An enormous sheet. Is it for Mark? And why not? 
for Mark and why not? <laughs> so it says. Charming. <laughs> and why not? How weird. Is that angry or is that friendly? <laughs> Mark doesn't know whether to be offended or not. No. What's happened? We just it was blood. blood. It was it was a <laughs> I knew you would. I knew your plan. No, because I thought if she didn't know which no, one we wanted. Which going to, that's why I sent it down. It's it would have been, so it would have been undignified for me to fight Rachel. Yeah, well. I could fight her. Whereas, you know, your cleavage versus... Did they not do that? Such a nice man down there. Look at the subs, subs, look at that. Do they not do J2I? Thank you. They don't do J2I. They don't do it. You've got that, sweetheart. Thank you. That's lovely. They did apple ties, but I wasn't sure if you liked that. Oh, thank you. Um, the subs like to know about wine. This one is Me Minuti. It's a very nice And he said colour. it's the best one. So have a little try, Alice. Just we recommended thing. it. The barman. It's got tones it, of and what I violet. The barman the loves the one that doesn't cost as much. <laughs> he says this Can is I the best one I've got. Does it have any? Does it have any whale feature? Barnacles. Well, the glass does. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is nice. It's clean. Barnacles. That's really nice. Do you want to drop them a beer? No, no thank, thank you. you. Oh so God. long, isn't it? Oh, it? Takes your head off. Well, I've got a roast chicken. Mm. Ali, you've gone for whale and chips. Whale. <laughs> <laughs> Rachel, what have you got? Oh wow, vegan nut vegan. roast. Vegan. Oh, it's amazing. It didn't say nut roast, it said cheese pie, didn't it? Vegan cheese pie. That's as big as your head. Yeah. So my chicken in my belly. Garlic well, and thyme chicken up. roast. We're having lunch all on our own in a banqueting hall in Bermondsey. Oh, Ned. Yes, There's no one are. here, look. What's the likelihood of that? So that means one can... Oh my God, I'm so full. I had everything, but I haven't had pudding, so we're now on the hunt for it. Yeah. And art, art and pudding. Art and pudding on the South Bank before we take these lovely people back to the station. They have to say goodbye and get no. on the train. Don't want them to go. It's been lovely, no, isn't it? It's so nice. It's such a, it's such a privilege to just hang out with mates and yeah. just like with, with proper time. Yeah. So you just have times we just sit quietly. I just and wish. I tell you what, I there's wish. There's always it's, more to find out about everyone. Yeah. But also that time we just spent in the pub, just chatting. Why would we just allow ourselves as a family to do that normally? I know. We wouldn't allow it, but because we have guests, it's like yes, we allow it. Yeah. It's lovely. 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 Okay, so we headed off to the Tate, didn't we, Cooks? And then we got snagged by the shop Joy. Do you know the shop Joy? It's not bringing us any joy. Then we go, her mum always takes me in and I don't like it. Yeah, she, mum thinks you love it. I never find anything funny. It's too self-consciously aware of trying to be funny. But it's look like at this. Women. But look at this. <laughs> what? Middle-aged women. But look at this electrics, of, electrics cable uh, unit. Red hot chili peppers. That's right. Smells. That's how I decorate it. Smell, it suddenly smells of poo. You get that in London and big cities. It's the smell of urbanness, <laughs> urban decay, and sewage. What Even have you, cheaper. What have you, yay! Look at that. Oh, isn't lady it gorgeous? In red. Oh, it's a song. This lady in red <laughs> is talking to me. Cheek to cheek. cheek. <laughs> <laughs> la la la, cheek to cheek, da la. Happy birthday to you. Oh, oh you look gorgeous. It's nice. so suits it, you. Isn't, isn't it? Beautiful. He it's loves so that palette so much. Oh. <laughs> it's gorgeous, isn't it? It's like it's made for her. Totally. Oh. Oh. It really Happy suits birthday. you. It really suits you. <laughs> Breast can keep your heart beating. Hello, guys. So we're back home and we are, I think, deservedly allowing ourselves to lie on the sofas and read the papers. And ro that bloody Toffee has just farted next to me. Oh, it's disgusting. Toffee. But the sadness is that. 
poor old Rachel and Ali aren't here. They've oh. gone. I know. So they're on the train. We had such a lovely time ending up at the Tate. Kiki's upstairs on her phone. She loved the exhibition. I'm looking at the garden thinking I've got to water it and try not to beat myself up knowing there's 60 million zillion jobs to do out there. And I've just got the best bits of the papers folded on my chest because I'm saving them for later like a squirrel. And now I'm going to go to sleep. Good night. It's Sunday night and I've decided and, off. and I'm showing I've decided to follow Nadia around the kitchen. Do you know why showing I've decided off. to follow you around the kitchen? Is it annoying? No, because look, look down there. We're both wearing Because I wondered what I was gonna be looking at. <laughs> We're both wearing what, what, what are we wearing? <laughs> Pajamas. So what are we doing now? We're gonna watch what? Love Island. I'm being very lazy. People don't like I'm the same. Frozen chips. Oh yeah. And fish. Frozen fingers. fish fingers for dinner. <laughs> and then what are we watching? Love, Love Island. Because Maddie's just returned from the park. Did you have a good time in the park? Maddie? Yeah. Did you have a good time in the park? Yeah. She had a good time in the park. We had a good time in Bermondsey. You're going to watch Love Island. We're going to watch Love Island. And then are we watching Killing Eve? Killing Eve. Fabaloony. Because I hear Everyone great things about this really second set. Yeah, exactly. Everyone thinks it's not going to be as good as the first one, but it is. Do you fry your fish fingers subs or do you grill them? I've always grilled them and my mum said to me the other day, but it's the stuff of madness. Grilling them, grilling fried... them. Yeah, I mean, it's not, it's not really healthy it's to very healthy. fry them. Mum loves fried stuff. She loves fried bread. Fries everything, 85. How old is she? 85? No, 83. 83 and fries every single morning of her adult life. She's a bacon bacon. Every single morning. She's just made of girders. War baby. War baby. Strong. And she can still Absolutely. keep everyone under the table. She's rock hard, our Betty. She's got a gullet made of titanium, Maddie. Titanium. Titanium. Say titanium. Titanium. Say titanium. 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 Yeah. 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 It's titanium night tonight in our house. What's happened? Um, I've burnt the effing fish fingers. I'm a celebrity master chef and I've burnt the effing fish fingers. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. What's wrong with you? I've burnt the fish fingers. I'm just going to say I've never burnt fish fingers. Yeah, we don't say that. Not unless you want a fish face. Just been watching the comments on tonight's vlog and someone said, watch Mark with the Majul dates. And what That's they don't realise is I've already had two. And Maddie's That's just... So, we are laughing so much. We love our subs so much. That's but Keith, hilarious. Maddie just said, if you know it's a disaster to have them, wouldn't that stop you? Therein lies the problem. No. I feel like that bug. Don't make it in... any more complicated than it is. No, it wouldn't stop you. No, but I'm like that bug in a bug's life that's flying towards the burning light and just burns itself up. So yeah, I've had two medjool dates. Well, you uh, better not have any more because you're going to ruin your I, Well, I'm going to undo four weeks. No, if you go over and you have that double pack of dates, yeah, you'll be, you'll be, you'll put yourself a week behind. A week? Yes. Hide the fucking things now. <laughs> you go and hide them. I don't well, I'll know where I've hidden them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's the point. I can't hide them. Hide <laughs> Maddie, Kiki, thinking. can you go over and hide them for me? Tony, there's no places left to hide anything. There's gotta be somewhere. <laughs> Otherwise I'll hide them in my stomach. Don't Thanks, sweetheart. Look at that, my Don't baby girl. Bringing... Hello, everybody. It's just about to start. Love Island. Say hello to our YouTube subs. It's just about to start. Who's watching? Only come on this live if you are watching Love Island. Otherwise, you're going to be bored. <laughs> I have to put that disclaimer. Oh, look, you're on our YouTube channel. I have to put that disclaimer on because otherwise people start saying to me, why are you just talking about... 
Love Island. Because we are unashamedly Love Island fans. Yeah. So, uh, Mark, stop filming. It's really annoying. <laughs>